guys welcome back to my channel one more time today i'm doing another haul video and in this video i spend 300 dollars on things at target um so the reason why i did this video is because i think watching these videos are super fun for me i love watching these videos on youtube and um just to kind of kill some time so my job requires well it doesn't require me like i don't have to wear fashionable things but i'm a visual and if you don't know what that is like you deal with mannequins um dressing them like the fashions like staple like clothing accessories um so all of that inspires me daily to look and the way I dress like I tell people all the time like I don't have like I don't just have a style like I have many different styles that tie into like me so um sometimes I have like a casual mom look I have like a cropped um grungy look I have a dark look I have like these preppy looks so I have diff all different kinds of looks so recently I've just been really into like getting really cute staple pieces um and then also like kind of splurge on those like denim jackets to layer on top and stuff like that so today at Target I went to go pick up some things um and like I said recently I have been picking up a few things and I don't do these hauls to like show off what I have um that's not at all why I do it it's honestly to inspire those other people out there who you know have like this fashion thing and who love to dress themselves up and to I know some people like it some people don't like I know my sister she doesn't always like she's not into like really fashion and what's the trend it's just kind of like whatever she wants she wants to put on that day really is what she has going on me on the other hand I like to plan my outfits I like to have like even whenever I don't I like to have like options already in the back of my head um, I'm just that type of person I mean, usually I do it in a very um, what's it called like I don't spend a lot of money on my clothing um, I, I work at a clothing store so I do get a discount for that um, and anywhere else I shop I usually do try to shop the discount the discount places today I just decided to go and splurge on some things for myself um, because all weekend I shopped for the kids and um, I I did shop for the kids too like I'm, I'm always shopping for my kids I feel like even whenever I don't intend to like I'm always like oh look at this so we'll start off with that guys with what I got the kids so the kids um, they got rain boots they got umbrellas and um, they needed rain jackets um and we're in that time um between like winter the end of winter and the beginning of spring um and spring it rains a lot where i'm from and here um where i'm gonna live it rains a ton so you definitely have to be prepared with like rain boots and um um what's it called rain jackets because i feel like just a jacket or like even one of those that look like rain jackets they don't really protect you from the rain um and yeah, so I just felt like the kids needed one. So I got this one for Anthony. Um, and usually they should say on the tag if they are waterproof. So this one says wind and water resistant. So um, you always want to look for that. Because sometimes I'm like, people just ask me like whenever they come into the store, like, do you guys have a windbreaker? And I kind of put like lead them towards um, like, you know, the material that's kind of like, this but it's not this if that makes sense so it's kind of like a cheaper version of this um and it doesn't it isn't rain and wind resistant um so just keep an eye out for that i know some things might seem like they are but reality they're not but like his hoodie even has like a little thing to go over his face oh yes it's so freaking cute if i had a rain jacket like this for me I would totally take it this one's Aaliyah's um and this one was 21 dollars it's for my babe so and talking about rain i got myself a rain um an umbrella i don't know where i was going with that an umbrella um just because it's raining here already so i definitely need an umbrella because i go to work and i right now i'm training at an outdoor mall so i definitely need an umbrella to like go and grab something to eat or just like walk around the corner for some coffee um like i said i've been really into like 
staple things and like really simple things that you can um, wear like underneath layers and stuff like that just because we're in that transition phase where it's like cold but hot so it's like you want to kind of put on light layers um, that you can just kind of take off so cardigans jean jackets things like that got this cute little tank top this is actually part of like their sleep wear i think but it's just like a little tank top like that and this one was five dollars and then i got some cute little kind of like what do you call this kind of material but they're just leggings that i was gonna wear with this and a, like a longer jean jacket that i have um and then just some like chunky sneakers which i think would look so cute also tried these leggings on and they weren't the most flattering thing on me um so i didn't really like the way they looked i was expecting them it kind of hit me like at a weird spot right here um where you could like see my little pudge and but there was still like the really thick band so it just it, it was not like it just was not flattering i feel like if the band hit lower it would probably because it has like this really thick band right here but then my pudge is like down here so you can definitely see that through the leggings and i just i just was not flattering on my body personally i'm really into like staple bags fanny packs kind of like those bags that go around your chest um and kind of like kind of look like a fanny pack but they're for here and not for here if that makes sense um and so i took um i've actually had my eye on this for a few weeks now and um it's not it hasn't been on sale where i'm at so it's kind of sucks but it's so cute i love how it's like see-through so i might just like put my my phone in there um i don't know it'll be cute to just carry a few things or just to even just like wear around my waist so i got that in a size of medium and this one was pricey too this one was 15 the old t-shirts these are kind of like cropped t-shirts but they're not so cropped i got a few cropped like t-shirts and like little um kind of tanks and they were too short for my liking like they hit like right about like here and like i like my crop to be like here where the sweater is because at any like higher it, i don't like it because it's a little too cropped for me and so i kind of have to wear an undershirt and it hasn't been my favorite so these little tanks definitely look like they're um more they're like longer this one's a little bit shorter but i have an outfit for this one so i think it's okay and this one's definitely more of a longer cropped t-shirt and both of these were five dollars i believe um let's see how much the black one was oh the black one was seven dollars i'm guessing because it's a different style i've been into really bright colors as you guys can see um so i got this cute it's again it's a, like a longer cropped shirt so i like it it hits me right where i want it this in, this in a size medium and it was 12 dollars but these pants here um and i got them in a medium hopefully they fit me they didn't have them on a large and usually i have like a large in the pants so uh, but i got them in a medium hopefully it does seem like i'll have some room to squeeze in it but i loved it and i'm gonna wear the white crop top with this and it was so cute on the mannequin so I got that and this one was super expensive. This one was $22. I don't know how I feel about these pants. Um, and I think it's because I don't know if I like it or dislike it. I don't know what's going on. that I really really loved part of their who what wear um, collection but if you guys can see the print it's really really pretty print um, and then this one was expensive too this one was $25 um, and I got a medium hopefully it fits right sometimes I feel like it will I feel like it'll cinch me at the waist button up like just sometimes you just get it in the arms and you're like yeah no this isn't gonna work like, I can already tell this is not gonna work um, but it was so cute. I like, can't even get the first button to button. Nothing else will button. But it's like, I love whenever it has a little flare here. I tried, it just didn't work out. So I just want y'all to know I have those moments too where it's like, girl, nope, thought. I'm so excited about this. This reminds me of like back in the day. And I've been traveling a lot, so I definitely need something to like just put my makeup in. Um, so you like open it up by like doing 
doing that and it just it just reminds me of whenever i was a little girl guys it's so cute so it opens up like this and then you have a mirror say hi guys you're in a weird stance right now because i'm filming this video but then it has like a little spot for all your little makeup and then you have like a big old empty spot down here for like palettes which would fit my palette so well um and i just think it'll fit everything so well in there um and this one was 20 dollars, i believe some more chunky sneakers they're all nude i think they're so cute i kind of want to get like a nude outfit or even with like that black little outfit that I had, like the leggings and the tank top. Um, that'd be really cute too, but just to wear this with it. And these were surprisingly really cheap. They were only $25. I also got this Lottie Slay All Day Lip Kit. And it's kind of like the Kylie Jenner lip kit, I'm guessing. But it's a um, it's in Boss. I got it in this cute little brown color. Got some little lip smackers for the kids because easter's coming up so i'm just getting a few things here and there for their easter baskets a few of my girl things so we're gonna put those aside those were it was like five for twenty dollars so it wasn't bad and then i got the physician's formula butter bronzer in a deep bronzer and then i got myself a coffee and that's what my three hundred dollars went towards so i'm really into like instagram pictures um so i'm trying to capture more things like that for you guys that i really really enjoy doing um that i kind of have let go out let go of throughout the years but i've always really loved fashion loved makeup i love putting myself together so i'm kind of finding that within myself again i think it's so important to take care of yourself and to love yourself and to pamper yourself so um that's something that I'm definitely doing this year for myself. And that, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoy these type of videos, make sure to give it a thumbs up so I will know that you guys like them. Um, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.